The great hall at Hogwarts was filled with excited chatter as former students reunited for the school reunion. Van hesitantly walked into the venue, wondering if attending the reunion was a good idea. She scanned the room, overwhelmed by the familiar faces, her heart racing when suddenly she spotted him, Jungkook, her ex-boyfriend. She couldn't help but notice how much he had changed since their time at school. Tall, handsome and effortlessly charming, it was as if absence had made him only more alluring. He was talking animatedly with some friends, their eyes locked for a moment, memories of their happy past come flooding back when they watched see each other for the first time after three years. But this only adds to their pain. Jungkook instantly looked away, pretending to be busy talking with his friends. And Jungkook's now strikingly handsome appearance made her feel a strange mixture of longing and dread. Moreover, there was a girl with him who was cleansing on his arm. Vyan's heart sank at the possibility of who she could be. Who's that girl with him? I have never seen her. Is she probably his new girlfriend? The way she is cleansing on him and he is also not resisting her proves that she is his girlfriend. Vyan mumbled to herself. Her chain of thoughts got broken and she gasped when someone hugged her tightly. I missed you so much, Van. I missed you too, Clara. But please, if you'll hug me one more second, then I'll die for sure, Van said, trying to break the hug. Clara pulled out from the hug after she realized that she is holding Van too tightly. Hey, hey, sorry, I got overwhelmed, Clara said while smiling nervously. It's okay, by the way, how are you? Vine asked with a smile, I'm fine, let's go meet our other friends, I can't wait anymore to meet them, I'm so excited, Clara excitedly said, ok let's go, Vine agreed and then they both made their way to meet their former friends. While talking to her friends, Vine was secretly taking lenses of Jungkook whose face was brightening up. He was busy in talking with his friends, Vine couldn't help but overthink about the girl who was with him. She was feeling pang in her heart by seeing her close with Jungkook. As if sensing her gaze, Jungkook turned to face Van and their eyes locked momentarily. Her heart raced before he excused himself from his friends and approached her. Van, he said softly, his voice laced with a mixture of caution and hope. It's been a while. Yeah, she replied awkwardly struggling to maintain her composure. It has. A heavy silence fall between them as they both racked their brains for something to say. Finally, it was Jungkook who broke the ice. Jungkook smiled slightly equally nervous. How have you been? He asked softly. I have been good. Life has been well. Van said while she anxiously fiddled with her bracelet, attempting to mask her nerves. I didn't expect to see you here with your girlfriend, she said softly while visiting her fingers looking down at the floor. Girlfriend? Jungkook asked confusingly. Van looked up at him before saying, Yes, the one who was cleansing to you just now, she said softly while not making eye contact with him. Jungkook realized that Van has misunderstood his friend's sister as his girlfriend. He was admiring her cute, jealous face. It made him extremely glad as it gave him hope that Van still had some feelings for him. So he decided to play along. Oh, that one. Oh, yes. She is little cringy type girlfriend. Jungkook said teasingly, but Van took it in a serious way. So she is really his girlfriend. Did he move on already? Was it that easy for him? And here, see me. It still stuck on him. I think now it's time for me to move on to. Van mumbled to herself in mind. Mm, excuse me, please, Van politely said. Yeah, sure, Jungkook said mockingly. Van went away from him. He was mischievously smiling while looking at her disappearing figure. Being sad and jealous at the same time, Van entered inside the restroom. She saw herself in the mirror before saying, isn't he supposed to explain me things? First he left me like I was nothing to him and now when he is back, he got a girlfriend already. Will not he explain why did he left me three years ago without giving any specific reason? He just left a note for me and didn't even met me before leaving me. He is supposed to explain me all these things but I think he is not gonna do that. He has moved on already. 
was all in tears now. She quickly wiped them and then washed her face. She turned around to go outside, but she found Jungkook walking towards her. He came and stood in front of her, stared her for a while, like he wanted to say a lot, but he couldn't. And he said something which made her weep. I missed you too. He said in soft, low, and husky voice, which made Wan tear up again because. She too really missed him so much, and he kissed her left cheek with his thumb. She couldn't hold back herself any more, and hugged him tightly, and showed her desperation that how much she missed him these three years. He pressed his lips together and shut them tightly as he really felt a sharp pain, but he hugged her back, and a tear escaped from his eyes. They both cried out of their hearts in each other's embrace. Then suddenly, Wan realized that Jungkook has got girlfriend now. She quickly broke the hug. Jungkook looked at her confusingly. Then, without saying anything, Wan ran away from there, wiping the tears with the back of her hand. Wan, he whispered in a low voice while trying to stop her, but he held himself back because he knew that she'll not listen to him now, as she is so disappointed in him for breaking her heart and trust. Next day, Wan was in her room looking at the ceiling while thinking about whatever happened at the reunion yesterday. Suddenly, the doorbell rang. Her mom called her to open the door, but she was too busy in her thoughts to listen to her. After getting no response from Wan, her mother sighed and herself went to open the door. Her eyes widened with joy as soon as she opened the door. Oh, Jungkook! She quickly wrapped her arms around him with a slight smile. He hugged her back. She kissed him all over his face in excitement, and then she broke the hug before saying, "You took too much time to come back, son. I missed you so much." She said, overwhelmed with happiness. "I'm sorry, mom. I missed you too." He apologized while a tear escaped from his eyes. She wiped his tears with her palm. He also wiped her tears with his thumb. While holding her cheek, suddenly their emotional moment got disturbed by Wan. Who are you talking with this early, Mom? Wan asked her mom confusingly while coming downstairs, trying to recognize the person who was standing back facing her near her mom. Wan stumbled back as soon as she realized that it was Jungkook with whom her mom was talking. Anger rushed through her veins on seeing him because firstly he disappeared without telling her. On top of that, when he has came back, now he has got girlfriend. Like she was nothing to him. Was her love joke to him? When he has moved on, then what is he doing here in her house? Why did you let him in, mom? She said angrily to her mom while staring at Jacob. Calm down, Van. Let's sit and talk quietly. Okay, dear. Her mom tried to convince her, but she was not ready to listen to anybody. She was just staring Jungkook with fierce gaze, her eyes screaming for explanation from Jungkook, but her mind didn't want to hear even a single word from his mouth. Mom, what's left to talk now? You know everything very well. Then why are you letting him in our house? She asked her mom. She felt tears escaping from her eyes. Wan, you are misunderstanding him, dear. Her mom tried to convince her. Seriously, mom, even after knowing how much I have suffered because of him, you are still taking his side. Are you for real, mom? Wan unbelievably said to her mom. Wan, dear, try to. Mom, please, I don't want to listen anything. If you have forgiven him just because he is your friend, son, then I'm sorry, mom, because I can't. I seriously can't forgive him, mom. She said while crying, and then went upstairs, wiping her tears with the back of her hand. Jungkook's heart sank on seeing her crying. He himself felt tear escaping from his eyes. Wan's mom approached Jungkook before saying, "I'm sorry, son. Because of me, you have to go through all this." No, mom. It's all right. You did nothing wrong. You just showed us right path back then. I'll make it up to her. You don't worry. I'll make. Sure to get my Wan back, Jungkook assured Wan's mother, and then he softly hugged her. Jungkook, go now and explain her that it was me who told you to go away. Don't waste any more time, son," she said, looking up at him.
Okay, mom, I'll try my best to get her forgiveness, Jungkook said and then went upstairs towards Swan's room. Wan was looking outside the window while folding her arms against her chest. She felt someone approaching her. She turned to check to see who it was, only to find Jungkook standing there staring at her with hopeful eyes. What are you doing here in my room? Just get out of here, Jungkook. Wan angrily shouted at him. Please don't shout at me, Wanny, Jungkook said with a cute sad pout. I'm supposed to be beating you after whatever you have done," she said with sarcasm. Jungkook chuckled internally at her sarcastic nature. "What are you doing here till now? Go away," Wan said while raising her brows. "I'll go away, Wan, but just please give me a chance to explain myself," he requested her with pleading eyes and cute pout. Wan's heart melted, and she also wanted to hear his explanation for leaving her, like she was nothing to him. So she decided to give him a chance to explain his perspective. You have five minutes, she said while looking at the watch on the wall. Isn't it too less to explain a lot of things? Your time starts now, Van said while staring at him. Okay, so back then, three years ago, we were both so obsessed with each other. We were so into ourselves that we forgot what was happening around us. We were literally skipping classes and escaping from his school to spend time with each other. Your mom was noticing our behaviors. She was tensed for our future. So one day while you were sleeping, she called me and explained me what we were missing. She made me understand that we were really so into ourselves that we forgot our future. I also realized that we were not focusing on studies. We were getting low marks. I'm sorry, I never really explained it properly. I felt like we were drifting apart, and with all the pressure of school and exams, I thought it was best for both of us to focus on ourselves. Van nodded slowly. I get it now. We were both so young then. You didn't want it to, our relationship to turn into something toxic that would distract us from our future. Exactly, Jungkook agreed. So mom asked you to go away without giving me any specific reason so that we both can focus on ourselves. Van asked with little uncertainty. Yes, Van. Jungkook nodded in agreement. Van got frozen on her place. She placed her hand on her forehead, trying to process everything and she looked up while trying hard not to cry. When she looked back into her memories three years back, she also realized that she was not taking her studies seriously. Suddenly. She realized that after Jungkook left her, she got so angry with him and then started to focus on herself. If he had not left her on her mother's saying, then she wouldn't be that successful which she is now. But now that time has passed, I can't help but think about what could have been if we had tried harder back then, Jungkook said with guilt. When I stared into Jungkook's eyes, saw genuine regret, a mix of emotions enveloped her hurt as she considered their love story. We can't go back in time and change things, Van said softly, but maybe we can start anew. A hopeful smile spread across Jungkook's face as he reached out to take Van's hand gently. I had liked that Van, he whispered softly. I'm extremely sorry for leaving you like that Van. I was, it's okay. You did that for our betterment and we and see we both are successful now because of that Van assured Jungkook. Thank you for understanding, Van. Mm, can I kiss you? He asked with hopeful eyes. Van hit Jungkook's chest playfully before saying, Why are you so straightforward? I don't know, Van. It's just I have been holding back myself for three fucking years. Now I can't wait anymore. He said, getting impatient. Van chuckled at his statement and then she herself smashed her lips against his. He quickly reacted back and kissed her personality like they had not kissed each other from deep. While kissing, Van suddenly realized something. He quickly pulled out from the kiss. Jungkook looked at her confusingly. Don't you have got a girlfriend now? She asked with a feeling of uncertainty. Jungkook realized about which girlfriend she is talking. He smirked internally before saying, So what, Van? She'll be my second girlfriend and you'll be my first. What nonsense are you saying? Are you for real, Jungkook? She shouted, being so done with him. 
Jungkook pressed his lips together trying hard not to burst out laughing but at last he couldn't hold himself and he burst out laughing loudly Wan looked at him confusedly she was so done with his pranks and all Jungkook explain yourself if you don't want to get wet enough she warned him raising her bro Wan she's just my friend's sister in short she's my sister too Jungkook explained Wan sighed heavily in relief after knowing the truth because for a moment she got scared that she almost lost him. What she looked at Jungkook after realizing that the last time he exclaimed her as his girlfriend just to tease her, she started hitting him playfully. Jungkook was enjoying this so much, he giggled and then picked her up on his shoulder and started running hither and thither. Wan told him to put her down, so he put her down. and then wrapped his arms around her back putting his chin on her shoulder after a while went to hug him back while hugging jungkook expressed her his feelings it's all my fault i really can't live without you please forgive me this once you are still the first one for me with whom i want to share each and every sorrow and joy of my life Okay then I'll be your first one to hear and share all the joys and sorrows of your life when said softly on hearing this Jungkook tightened his grip on her and hugged her more tightly Now let's go to tell mom about our reunion Jungkook said with a smile while giving Wan's hand Yep let's go Wan nodded in agreement They both bent down their stairs towards Wan's mom who was sitting on the couch in the living room. Mom, thank you for thinking about us and making us realize that sometimes people leave us to make us brighter than before. Wan said while approaching her mom. And thank you mom for not separating us forever. I remember you told me to get successful as soon as possible to get Wan back and here I am. Jungkook said proudly. Yes, Wan. It was me who told Jungkook to get away from you. He was not at fault. Just for Mom, I know. Jungkook explained me everything, and we are together now. You don't worry. Wan assured her mom. Really? You convinced her, Jungkook? Wan's mom asked Jungkook surprisingly. Yes, Mom. It was a little hard, cause she is quite stubborn. But you know, I am also the John Jungkook. She can't refuse me, so I convinced her. He said proudly. Her mom giggled after hearing him. Aren't you too confident? Wan asked, raising her eyebrow while putting her hand on her vest. Ani, Ani, ah, Wan, I was just kidding. Jungkook said cutely while hugging Wan. I was kidding too. Wan said while bursting out laughing. Look at your face. You are so scary, cat. Mom, did you saw how she make fun of me? Jungkook complained to Wan's mom with a cute pout. No Wan, don't tease our bunny. See how cute he is. Still you tease him. She said while kissing Jungkook's hand. See, see, mom is on my side. Jungkook said teasingly while showing his tongue to Wan. Mom, now see who is teasing. Wan annoyingly said to her mom. Ah, kid, stop now. I love you both. Now come and give me a hug. Jungkook and Wan looked at each other and then hugged their mom. She hugged them back while smiling brightly. I'm sorry for separating you both back then but at the time I thought that it was necessary so I had took that step now I'm happy for you both Wan's mom confessed while patting Jungkook and Wan's back it's okay mom we believe you and we love you so much Jungkook and Wan both sat together as they continued talking Wan and Jungkook rekindled their old friendship As forgiveness was given and received, the seeds of possible new romance between them began to blossom once again.